everyone, a really warm welcome back to the channel. I'm at the NEC in Birmingham and today I'm going to look around this little Adria action. These things are fantastic. I really, really love the shape of these things. Such a funky curve on the right. Anyway, this is the 361 LT, uh, which is two berth, parallel, pa can't even speak now, parallel lounge at the front, uh, which converts to a massive double bed. So. Uh, two meters by two meters, I think, or thereabouts. Uh, rear kitchen and rear corner washroom. Uh, so that's what we've got. It is a total shipping length of just over 5.2 meters long. So it's super short, easily manageable. And uh, the width is good as well at about two, just short of 2.2 meters. Uh, in terms of weight, 1300 kilograms MTPLM, uh, and the mass in running order is. A 957 kilos which gives you a payload of 330 see with these little caravans you get fantastic payloads um, because of course they are much smaller overall but still running on the same chassis anyway uh, price apparently is from 23,610 pounds on the road um, it's starting to get a little bit busy here but uh, so hopefully we will just wander in there and have a look without disturbing any of the real people once his viewers are finished, so let's just have a little look around the outside while we're waiting to do that. Anyway, uh, it's freed up, so let's go. Oh, spoke too soon. <laughs> we won't go in this time. Okay, let's try that again. And uh, maybe not. Okay, third time lucky. Right, we're going for it this time. Honestly, it was quiet when I came in here. Now Right, so two-piece door, I think I mentioned that already. And then kitchen uh, directly on the right as you come through the door. Small kitchen, but uh, for such a small kitchen, actually the workspace isn't too bad. You've got a bit of a space at the side there. Let's go and look at that front first. So there are those two windows from the inside. Yeah, there's no chance for a five-foot person like me seeing any of those, but uh, still get plenty of light in at least. Just have to stand up if you want the view. Then behind the front lounge, we've got this storage cupboard. Lots and lots of space in there. Fridge over. Hmm. Perhaps this isn't built for short people because there's no way I'd be able to reach the top of that fridge shelf. I'm back in the kitchen. Uh, big top level storage locker. There's that curve. So you can see the back wall is just um, kept flat with this panelling, but they've made the most of it in terms of storage areas with cubbies and so on. And then three massive drawers down here. Lend your room for all your bits and pieces. Um, I guess you'd have to be careful to make sure your nose weight isn't too light if you've got lots of stuff at the back. And then off on the side here, uh, perfectly formed little wet room. Quite well set up there, you know, shower in here and Adria's uh, classic fold away basin. I really love these things. You know, fold away basins tend to be ugly, but these Adria ones are absolutely beautiful. So sink at the bottom, storage over the top, that loo directly underneath, and shower there. So all in all, very simple little tidy setup. More drawers on the left side here. If you have a TV, that can go um, on the mounting bracket on the wall there. And then you've got storage for sort of nicks and necks, top level, as well as narrow cupboards. I'll put the top here over the front lounge area. Um, as is ubiquitous in continental vans, they've got some net curtains here. These are quite modern, funky ones. So panels rather than you know, pleated net curtains there. Reading lights down from the shelves above. You've got coffee, storage area. And then to make up the bed for the night, you just pull out the slats here. Um, and then easy access underneath there for shoes or bits and bobs. All right, that's it. Hope you enjoyed the, the quick tour of this Adria Action 361. Um, do do the thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already, and I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching, and uh, I guess bye for now. See ya.